Hey, what's going on? Uh, this is a super short, super brief video, but I just got off of a uh, video call with a person who's a friend of a friend in, a, in the uh, ecosystem that got fished uh, from the Ledger wallet snafu. Okay, so just to catch you up, Ledger... Uh, leaked something like maybe 10,000 to all their uh, customers account information. Just imagine any information you'd put in on that website in order to do what you got to do being uh, now in the hands of, of uh, criminals. And the phishing attack that he got was pretty simple, kind of went like this. Uh, there's been a phishing attack. Your device may be compromised. Click here to go um, uh, verify some things, whatever. And it actually installed what looked to be like a Ledger Wallet app. The app, not just some website portal. It might have been a website, but the way that it was described to me is it looked like some kind of an interface where you would put in the 12-word seed phrase in the app, okay? That doesn't happen with Ledger devices. All that happens on the device, in person, handwritten on a card, or however you store your seed phrase. <clears throat> Guys, these hackers are socially engineering you to, you know, they're telling you, be very careful, never share your seed phrase with anybody, and they've warned you multiple times about this, and then you go ahead and do it. Don't do it. And the problem is we got to get this message out to people who maybe, um, you know, they're just casual crypto enthusiasts. They, they don't follow it day to day. They don't even know about the hack because I feel like Ledger's done kind of a piss poor job getting the word out uh, early on, especially. And uh, this is the result of that. And so, unfortunately, uh, we're looking at the blockchain information. It looks like those coins are getting split up into different wallets. And, you know, the spider web, you know, gets spun. And I'm sure they're going to find their way into some foreign exchange uh, or, you know, some kind of an exchange uh, not on U.S. soil or at least not on any soil that would involve extra, extraditing those funds. So I uh, always assume that they're gone. I don't know what Ledger is going to do about this. You know, maybe they're sending out an email one time, you know, to uh, acknowledge that there's been an issue, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. I, I just wish that people uh, wouldn't get taken advantage of by these criminals. And just be careful. Don't click on links in any emails, okay? Uh, make sure you have the official Ledger app from the official Ledger website. And then make sure you keep your Ledger updated. And God for please don't put your your seed phrase into any any website portal or app looking thing and uh, when in doubt something I've done before if you're not sure close the laptop down for the night and research it for a day before you go back to it the next day okay that's all I got cheers